Hello, my name is Stephen Hughes. Um, you might have been seen some of my posts on I Live in Pembrokeshire, I Love It, Council Watch, and I've put some on the VOP sites. Um, what my engagement here is, is trying to show you um, how we've been affected by footfall. Um, principally, the main reason I believe in footfall has decreased is online shopping. I'm currently walking down here now to the green in Hufferford West. Online shopping has made a huge difference to the way that we, uh, we shop. 20% cheaper sometimes than any product that you can get online. Yet, technology, and the thing that I've got in my hand, as well as we all know is a mobile phone, uh, iPads, um, children and adults, social engagement. There's another thing as well. Um, the reason I'm going to say this is how many of you actually do engage in conversations these days. I know it sounds bizarre and I'm going to be quite critical of it, but I had, do find that a lot of people have what I call the, the penguin effect and keep their head down and uh, are more engaged in their mobile phone than they are actually talking to people. Now, when I'm going to past here, I'm just going past Harris Brothers and it's deeply important that I go this way because what I'm going to do is to go to the Rifleman Field and um, we're going to have a look at the parking situation here because obviously parking was introduced at the back of the new gymnasium and there was a surcharge and it was introduced with parking and it's the same on the green and we should be having a look at that and then we'll make our way down to Market Street and then we'll have a look at St Mary's we'll have a look at some of the shop situations to see what's closed, see what's open, see what's available and what we can actually think is value for money and obviously I would like to engage you knowing that um, certain people have tried their best to enhance Hufferford West and have done a lot and they're members of the council so I don't want you to think that I'm anti-council or I'm going to have a go at the council because we've got to give a level playing field here um, what my my social engagement is for you to have a look and engage and feel what we've got to offer what we can do and what this town offers um, the town offers quite a lot. It, it, it really, really has a massive history that goes back goes back to the 17th century, 16th century. Um, it's beautiful old buildings that we did have. We had the Swan Hotel, was the end of Bridge Street. Unfortunately, that was demolished due to dry rot. And I believe around about the 1970s, people can quote me on that. Um, um, we had the old cinema the Cavendish Furniture Shop, and that was currently where the council buildings are now. Um, social engagement. What I want you to do is to tell me how we can improve, um, what we're doing wrong, and what the council, and how we look at this town, and how we look at things that can improve this town, and the social engagement of, do we get value for money? Because that's extremely important. Um, we're all being hit hard with price hikes, um, rent rent rises, uh, council tax hikes. Um, I will go on about council tax. I, I, it's the bane of everything at the moment. Um, cutting costs and unfortunately the austerity that's continuing. Whichever way you're looking at it, tell, tell me that, that it's at an end. It's not. It is continuing. And we're all finding it extremely difficult, especially people on low incomes. And I will harper on that. And you must remember that Wales is in England. Our wage structure is slightly lower. We are struggling on minimum wages. There's a lot of people in part-time jobs which are taking off the unemployment register. And just remember, that is the way to get the figures down. If somebody's on a 16-hour or 8-hour contract, we'll get them off the figures. Right. Now, so the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the Rifleman Fields car park. It's Tuesday, and I just want to see how many people are actually here. <laughs> 